All right, hey guys, welcome back to the fifth part of the new uh, Europa Universal series we're doing here. Uh, my name is Anthror, and we are Brandenburg. Uh, Steam servers are back up, so we're back here to see what we can do. Um, I can't really remember what we did last time. Um, ah, Hansa have rebels. Ha ha ha. Uh, we are currently, yeah, okay, so we've got these three guys as vassals. We are allied with um, Austria and Poland. We were allied with Poland, but then they got mad when I took some, took some stuff. Austria, Royal Marriage Alliance. So we just have a Royal Marriage with Poland and with Denmark, but they've rivaled us because they're jerks. Um. Oh, well, Hungary no longer has, uh, or Austria no longer has Hungary as a rival. Hungary have Austria? They do. That would hurt our relationships a little bit. Uh, we're just going to kind of keep going with things as they are. Tonic Order left the coalition. That's good. These game sounds are a little wacky. Uh, let's see, do we have any... Uh, Brunswick hates us. We're never going to make enough guys to protect against Denmark. Call from Poland. Poland, come on. I don't think we're ever going to be able to come paper controller at any time in the near future. Got like no points. So no missions for us right now. Uh, we do have some revolt potential in Danzig. But I think it'll be okay. Um, why do we have 3%? War exhaustion. Ah, oh, my war exhaustion's high. But is nationalism like a county modifier or something? How much would it cost? Uh, with the protection of the Emperor, increase Imperial authority. Hmm. Not yet, but potentially down the road. Uh, this is 120. Not going to happen. We'll deal with the whatever revolts happen. Uh, how are we doing money-wise? We are making 570 with our maintenance at about half. That's not bad at all. We got a few boats. I think we're probably at our force limit, if I remember correctly. Oh, no. We could have... Five more guys and another boat. Hmm. Potential. Uh, how far are we away from cannons is a good question. Next level. So, cool. Next level of uh, military tech. We'll try to get some cannons. So I'll probably leave a little bit of room in my force limits for that. Um, should be doing okay on trade. We're gonna, we control a good chunk of Lubeck. Whoa. Uh, yes. Oh, there are the Prussian rebels. Prussian patriots. Ooh, and 12 of them. Damn. Um, that sucks. So let's turn our maintenance back up. Let our morale kick around a bit. We have a... Meh. We have a leader. For the love of God. Reinflation. There we go. Whatever. Uh, come over to here. Ridiculous. Well, he may accept the peace with Bavaria. Wow. Bohemia took three counties from Bavaria. They're getting big. The, man, the HRE is coalescing into some big countries. I feel like maybe we should try to make friends with these idiots. They hate us. Uh, who wants military access? Utrecht? Sure. Let's see. Oh, they've got a crap for a leader. Should be able to take them. No problem. Go to here. Really should, like, knock that revolt risk down when I just killed 12,000 of their men. But, you know, what do I know? But we got a lot of inflation. It is going down, though, because we have that guy. What is who's at war with everybody? Where's Utrecht? Yeah. Um. Oh, Denmark is trying to conquer Lubeck. They're gonna get it. Do I have a claim? I do. I couldn't get anybody to come with me though, could I? Oh, Austria is on the same side as the enemy. Oh, right now, yeah, of course. So Austria is going to be fighting Denmark. Um, that looks like Austria is winning. 
Although Denmark has got all their guys right there. Uh, I've totally come help out. Ah, Poland, why are you such a jerk? Yeah, so I definitely need my royal marriage with Denmark to end. That would be helpful. A Bohemia, man. Someone needs to kick their ass. I think they have a Saxon province. Yeah, this one. Niederschlust, or whatever. Oh, they got a couple of them. <clears throat> yeah, so these two. Uh, let's start fabricating some claims on these guys. Start with Nieder, Niederlaust. Oh, we can't fabricate on Oberlauschitz. Not except the culture in Brandenburg. So, no, we want these two. If anything, let see if we can't get Austria on our side at some point. Trade dispute against Burgundy. Works. Got lots of money. Maybe we should build uh, some non-military things. Those, maybe build a dock. Um, should be okay. Constable. Not too gold there. Yep. Okay. That's enough buildings. Let's sit back, make our six gold a month. Things are going well. Stupid Poland. Who are you guys allied with? Slavonian order is my huh let me see here they're just allied with the Livonian order I wonder if I could go to war with them it's fabricating Lindberg you got Lindberg you like me enough yeah okay come on back we're gonna we're going to see about going to war with these guys. Let's get our... Oh, wait. Truces. Oh, truce is up, so it should be totally doable. Uh, let's get our maintenance back up. We've only got, like, four guys. You guys go to Danzig, please. Looks like Austria is already at war with the Livonian Order. Um, That's weird. Austria's just got... Access, I guess. I think I could take these guys on my own. Uh, depends on how many men the Livonian Order have, though. Let's go check that out. Oh, do do do. If I sound a little bit tired, guys, it is because I am. Livonian's got 9k. We can totally do this. Yeah, I'll take, um, we have claims on stuff, right? At least on this one, don't we? Oh shit, do I not have a claim? I do. I have Asta person. Good. I feel like I... Oh, I'm gonna try to vassalize him. Uh, where are we at on our diplomatic thing? I think we're at 4 or 4. Look, it's fine. Or 6 or 6, yeah. And we'll be fine once Denmark dies. Alright, so we're up to full morale. Let's see if we couldn't get Austria in on this war. I don't think so, because they're already at war. This is really gonna piss off... Uh, Poland some more, but whatever. We'll see if we aren't uh, overextending ourselves quite dramatically here. And did the Livonians join in? They did. Let's wipe their army out. Yeah, they're their nine guys. All right. Um, catch a siege. Go up there. Catch a siege. Seven go to there. Should be fine. And we'll save Memel for last. Doesn't look like they're wanting to come up here anyway. You better run. Yutch. Cool. Well, we can invest in a cardinal. Uh, we're going to wait until someone dies, I think. Oh, good. We've got our all our allies with us. This should be fine. We'll just, uh, it'll be 15 aggressive expansion. A lot of that is going to go toward Poland. Um, 
Well, it doesn't look like they're, they're suffering any aggressive expansion relations against us. It's good. Uh, what is this? Incompetent diplomats or simply diplo? I'll lose the prestige. Whatever. We're gonna get some more back for the war. It looks like these guys must be. No, oh, it's weird. They must just have um, military access for Austria going on. Is Austria winning that war? I hope so. Denmark needs to knock down a notch. Ooh, minus 21. Go back. And Denmark's got 30, 23 guys over there. How are they moving through my, my land? Why? I don't understand. Uh, do we have any good missions? I'm not really going to take it, though. I'm going to just vassalize these guys straight away. No, oh, Danzigian Patriots. Fine. I could potentially sell back these provinces to the to the Teutonic Order. That might make Austria less pissy, or Poland less pissy at me. We'll see how things go. Oh, this is sieging super fast. Do, 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 do. Let's see. Speed of succession, nowhere useful. We should be able to crush these guys. There's going to be a river crossing, but we have a lot of men. Oh, and some of our guys are going in. Nice. Going and uh, sieging the Livonian Order's land. Oh, let's see. 45 ducats. Yeah, buddy. I like me some ducats. Rip all these idiots up. Not even using that much of our manpower. It's pretty nice. Good. That's all taken. We're about to take Memel. We're just going to make Livonian Order give us some money, I think. They can't even get to us. They don't have uh, access rights with anyone. Oh, maybe Austria will take care of those rebels for me. That would be superb. Looks like they're about to. Go get in on that. Get some prestige out of the battle. Nope, too fast. Damn. Thanks, Austria. Appreciate it. As soon as Memel falls, we should be good. I don't think they're too big to vassalize. They should be small enough. Although, Austria person is like a level 8. It's a memo. Level 3, 6, 3. Should be okay. Let's see what we can get. Can I vassalize you? I can. Awesome. Alright, so before we do that, let's see if the Livonians will peace out. I doubt they'll give me anything. Yeah, no. Alright, that's fine. Um, I could fully annex them. Holy crap. That's actually not that bad. A lot of aggressive expansion. It's gonna piss off a lot of people. The over the overextension's not terrible though. My vassal, give me all your money. Ooh, that's a lot of money. Seventy nine. That's good. Cool. Uh, so fifteen AE. That's gonna go toward Bohemia, Denmark, Lithuania, Poland. That's a good bit, but that'll burn off pretty quickly. We will vassalize these guys. Beautiful. Immediately start um, improving relations with them as soon as possible. Actually, I'm going to see if I can't sell them. Oh, Chelmo is Polish, huh? Well, Poland doesn't have a claim on it. Uh, 6th of November, almost time. They have no money. My fault. They would take it, and then I don't have... Oh, did I already core it? Yeah, I cored it, and I cored Warmia too, didn't I? Yeah, so screw that. We're not going to do that. You guys go back to home. Cool. And, uh, well, yeah, we need to improve relations with these guys. So right now we have a lot of vassals. Um, these idiots are going to suck to integrate because 
their HRE members. But maybe I'll just let them hang out for a little while. Um, and I'll just start integrating. Can't integrate four at a time. Yeah. I think, was it Lindberg that was first? Annex, I could start annexing these guys. And probably Sax Lindberg too. Yep, and Mecklenburg. Almost. So I could do all of these guys, but it's going to lower the opinions of everybody in the HRE of me by like 75. Because that's ridiculous. Let's wait until we get to the end of. And until we get the new military tech. We'll go improve our relations with the Pope for the time being. More points to spend on stuff. Probably at our cap. Uh, reform desire is only about 40%. 51. It's our cap. 52. Alright. Lose this guy. This guy's not going to get anywhere. Shoot. Are we ahead of time? We are not. Good. Very good. Very good. Let's build some cannons. We can build seven more guys overall. Right now we've got 13 four, so we're definitely going to build four cannons. Build five cannons. That'll bring us up to 22, and then we'll build two more infantry guys. Good. Expensive, and it's going to really cost us on the maintenance, but we need to be ahead. Yeah, I bet you we're pulling a buttload of money in now. Oh, Austria's starting to fight back in this war against Denmark. Oh, they're at plus 37 now. Oh, no, Denmark's at plus 37. Never mind. I would really like Denmark to not get Lubeck. That would be better for me if they didn't. Uh, come on, Poland. Quit being a jerk. I mean, I need, uh, yeah, I need Denmark's guy to get to die, maybe Poland's too, and then I'll buddy up with uh, Hungary, Hungary or Lithuania, one of the two. This has a thirty-two supply limit. We'll be fine there. A nice big army. Uh, yep, yeah, we're not gonna be able to. Polar uh, table control. Kind of annoying. Mm -hmm. It's still. God. What's up, Danzig? Why do you have patriotism or whatever? Nationalism. Oh. So my thought is I'll, I might. I should wait until. Because this guy will get a big minus from every vassal that I integrate, um, just in general. Can't royal marry them, which kind of sucks. I need to keep their opinion high, so I'm going to just have to sit here with a lot of vassals for a while. But as long as I can stay allied to Austria, things should be fine. Aggressive expansion's about to go away. I'll go back and improve relations with them as soon as I top off some of these guys. You can you can definitely stop that. And yeah, we'll top off Austria. I would very like to help you in this war, Austria, but you never called me in. Oh, are you kidding me? Loyal to France. Oh, 51. Wow. I thought it was 50. We are 55. That sucks. Ugh. Stupid Curia. East Frisia, whatever, don't care. Diplo power. What is our ideas? I think they're diplo ideas, right? I think. Uh oh. Permanent causes Bella against those idiots. And nothing's too crazy good, and I think we're pretty far behind on tech, so we'll probably wait up for tech on the diplo side of things. Oh. We're not ahead? Hmm. 
Interesting. And how far ahead are we at military? 120 years. Okay. Uh, or 112 years. All right. So we'll go ahead and do that. And we're next idea. We're going to take a military idea. And we're going to probably get offensive. Uh, either offensive or quality. So this is more infantry combat, morale recovery, cavalry combat, ship, navy morale, light ship, artillery, discipline plus 15 is really nice. Uh, this gives discipline plus 10, and it gives force march, shock, manpower modifier, leader fight. Yeah, no, offensive. Way to go. Cool. So, yeah, hopefully we'll make some, uh, we'll get some good uh, points. Keep that guy for the time being, and how much are we making? Four going. Not very much. Oh, we need the points. I want to get. Uh, I want to get those military ideas. They're really strong. Let's see, and our heir is. Oh, he's got five military score. That's pretty good. I would deny that petition. I don't think I turned down my maintenance. That's probably why we're not making that much money. Oh, I did. Sheesh. Oh, there go my vassals trying to help out. Oh, don't even need to move down there. Beautiful. Alright, stay in Brandenburg. And we'll turn maintenance back down so we're making some money. Probably good. Cool. Yeah, so... If uh, Denmark could just go ahead and die, that'd be super good. How old are you? 34. Ugh. No dispute of succession. Bavaria, but we're not royal married to them. They're tiny now. Oh, there we go. Austria's turning the war around. Very good. Boom. Yeah, Denmark's going to get rough, roughed up. Who are our rivals? Hansa, Denmark. Poland's rivals are us and Bohemia. I feel like maybe I should rival Bohemia to get a less, like... Oh, nobody hates Bohemia, of course. Uh, Burgundy, I think. Do I still have Burgundy? I should. I would like to keep enemy of enemy. No, you know what? I don't. So I'm going to go ahead and put Burgundy back in there. Uh, just because I want to keep Austria up on good side. There we go, 200. Oh, Saxony's going after part of Brunswick. That is, a, that is a big old coastal Brandenburg I got going on. I like it. Ugh. All right, trying to attack my timer here. Uh, so what else is going on? Hejaz is being taken over by Mamluks. Muscovy is going to form Russia pretty soon. Denmark integrated Norway. Wow, Denmark is strong. Um, wow, you lost? Oh, that is bad for us. Yeah, that's not good at all. I need... Nope. And now they won't take an alliance. Oh, they would if we improve relations with them. Come back from Rome. I need somebody on my side. Hungary's crappy. Lithuania? Yeah, they'll take an alliance. That sucks. Uh, alliance from... <laughs> Trier. That's cute. And Poland, why do you gotta be such a jerk? Right, let's see if we can't get an alliance with Lithuania. Uh, no Trier, no Saxony, sorry. Lithuania is where it's at these days. Yes, Lithuania. Except. Who's this? Muscovy? Ah, oh, I would like to, but you're way too far away. Although you could fight Denmark for me. Yeah, you know, and we're going to go pretty high above our... Ah, oh, shoot. I did not mean to do that. Let's see, where are we at? We're at 
8 of 6 would be 9 of 6. We're going to lose Poland and Denmark uh, when somebody dies. We're going to start integrating guys soon, so we'd, be, we'd still be 1 over. But I'm not going to really get anywhere with these with my Diplo points if we do this. We're going to have to start integrating people soon. How soon until I can integrate you? Uh, seven more years. Ah, fine. I need I need allies I need them quickly. Sorry, I totally did not mean to deny that alliance. I misclicked. I'm sure, these two are gonna go to war with each other and destabilize me in the meantime. What else do we got? Improve relations with Poland. Screw Poland. I'm mad at them. Good. Should be good. We'll get our alliance back with Austria in five years. So, improve relations over here. And over here. Good. Because I think Denmark is my biggest concern at the moment. I think I could take Poland. Denmark is very, very strong. I'd like to fight them and make them release Norway. Um, England's not doing much of anything. Wales got released somehow. Oh, well, Granada still exists. Castile is slacking off. Um, ba -do -ba -do -ba -do. sure. I mean, did our mind power boat wise go up by two? That's all right. I think the uh, before they had a pretty big mil um, navy, the Livonians, but I don't know if or the Teutons. I'm not sure if they still do or not. Oh, we'll just hang out. Oh, we can invest in a cardinal. Not really. Okay. Let's see. How is our... How's our inflation? Still really high. 25 admin points. How are we doing on tech as far as admin goes? It'd be alright to spend some of it? Yeah, we're still way ahead. Let's do that. Then... Just drop it by by one. Oh, we can do two. Let's drop it by two. I know inflation's not the biggest of deals. It just makes everything so expensive. I will make 330, and then we're going to get rid of this admin guy for a while. I need to make some money in case we need mercenaries or something. But we've got, uh, we've got what we're going to need to form Prussia, uh, which is pretty good. Um, we're just going to need to go... Uh, Protestant at some point, and then, you know, see how that goes. Reformation's always pretty interesting. Um, Lithuania is Catholic. Uh, usually Bohemia goes, and a lot of these uh, northern uh, HRE members will go uh, Protestant, which is good. Austria tends to stay Catholic. So does Poland, Hungary, and Lithuania. Oh. Sometimes Denmark will go. A lot. Actually, I think more often than not, Denmark goes... Um, you know, I'm actually going to go and probably try to improve relations with Denmark because I don't want to fight them. I am pretty mad at Poland. Like, we could be friends. Um, oh, I don't want you to die. What do I have as a backup option as far as that goes? It's going to cost money to recruit someone, too. Um, got national manpower and discipline at level 2. Uh, no, that's fine. We got some admin points, that's cool. So, what should we build? Constables are good. Ooh, 260 in Danzig. Yeah, buddy. 40, 140. 40, I said. 120. Yeah. Gotta spend money to make money, you know? Uh, accumulate money. Oh, how much? 185? I think we can do that. Oh, cool, so we'll just not spend anything for a little while. Good, good, good. Yeah, so we're, we're pretty big. We're pretty good. It's going to be a nice big chunk we got up here uh, once we can integrate these guys in, like, forever. And we're not even close to... Well, we're not that far away. Another 70. We should be able to get up to 190 without a problem. Uh, and then we'll start integrating um, 
this guy first, and then, uh, what is this? Uh, I don't want to lose Diplo power. I'm not going to be fabricating for a while. The prestige hit kind of sucks. We're losing. Oh, not that bad, actually. Losing a good bit per, per Majiggy. All right. So yeah, so uh, we will we'll integrate these guys. Uh, we'll start annexing them. I think Mecklenburg is level five, three, five. So Saxonburg will be last. So we'll do all three of these guys at once, uh, probably. Although I'll probably just do two and then two. So I can maintain a diplomat. But when I save money, have I unlocked the embassy yet? Hey, there we go. How far behind are we here? Oh, no, we're going to go for the tech. That's really far behind. Get a little bit more trade income while we're at it. Trade's only about three gold at the moment. It'll be up to a lot more once we can uh, start, once we get these three guys in in integrated. And uh, maybe be able to take out the Hansa at some point. Okay, let's see if we can't take this guy away from Castile. Dump all our points into him. All right. Yeah, so uh, unique buildings, not yet. I think that's maybe the next level of admin tech will be. Or well, diplo tech. Which one is it? Oh, some one of them unlocks the embassy, which would be nice to get another uh, another diplomat kicking around. We're going to try to do a lot of stuff uh, diplomatically. A lot of crap going on. It's actually kind of nice not to have to worry about allies so much. Muscovy would definitely be a big help against Denmark. Same with Poland. Okay, Austria just got re-elected. That's fine. We're buddy-buddy. Like that. So it was just under three before. Let's see if it goes up at all. Yeah, just over three. Nice. Oh, wow. Yeah, I went up almost uh, almost a whole gold. Like, three quarters of a gold. We're now making close to six bucks, which means we're only, uh, like, six months away from... Any, yeah, six, six, seven months away from completing our mission. Give us ten prestige back. Should be really nice. Very, very good. Okay, let's recall our guy from Denmark. Got him all the way up to negative ten. Pretty good. 200, 105, 200. So we'll go here. Guy is up nice and high. What was it? Was it, it wasn't 88, was it? That seems too far away. 88, geez. Five more years. We'll get there, though. Once we get them integrated, we're going to be in really good shape. Then maybe if we can get Austria, Lithuania, and Muscovy on our side, we can go to war with Denmark. And, I don't know, maybe take Skane or Gotland or something. Gotland, we don't have a... It'd be hard to get a claim on Gotland. Uh, maybe Holstein. Or at least make him release, yeah. We'll take Holstein and Slevig or whatever. Or just Holstein. I don't care. So, how's the army? We've got... Yeah, 15-4-5. That looks pretty good. For this time frame of the game. I know later on... Uh, the cavalry get a lot less important, um, unless I think you're Poland. Skills, yeah, we're only, we're only, oh god. You need to die, you need to die. How old are you? 35. Regency Council. Ugh. How did our thing not end? That sucks. How old am I? I'm 70. Oh, I'm going to die any minute. Okay. Ooh. Well, speaking of, let's see. Uh, we've got... He's got a strong claim, so we'll get that legitimacy back. Uh, the prestige is kind of sucky, but yeah, that's good. Let's do that. And let's go to our military. Oh. Oh, that's nice. You get Clemens von Mach. And then we're going to fire our other dude. So 
Sorry, Albrick. You served us well, but my goodness, look at that guy. 343. Three. Really nice. That's going to come in handy later on. Oh, yeah, so our guy's going to die any minute. He's 70. And then hopefully that'll wipe our uh, royal marriages with Denmark and Poland and get us down to only being one above our our limit for d diplomatic relations. So we'll play just a few more minutes until and see if that happens. And then uh, if not, we got to cut the video because we're getting a little bit over time. Nothing really super crazy is happening. I mean, Serbia's there, which is, you know, it's like an every third or so time occurrence, it seems like for me. Muscovy is huge. Bohemia is going after Thuringia. Bohemia is getting, getting a little bit pushy. I feel like they probably have to have an alliance or a coalition against them by now. That's the wrong button. Yeah, just the one Wurzburg. Although, if they keep going. Actually, if they take the Ringia, that's going to get them another, like, 15 AE. And then I'll push some people into some coalitions. At that point, I might join. Did I, did I ever end up getting a claim on this? Oh, they converted the... Wow, they converted the culture. Yerks. I do have a claim on it. suck oh we're about to get a military idea get our first oh well this is wait which one is this yeah leader shock that doesn't do too much for us in the short term but i think that only counts when you create a new leader so if we had gotten that a little bit before we had gotten our new general he would have had uh five shock would have been nice uh, accumulate money is complete Legitimacy. I think I'm going to select this because we're going to die very soon and our new guy should get 100% legitimacy when he takes over. Which will be handy. Um, we still have our cardinal. Do. Good. Not going to build anything just yet. This farm estate. Expensive. Probably worth it though. I'm going to make all goods plus 100%. Just in the province that it's in, though, I wonder if that's the case or not. Muscovy is at peace. Lithuania is at peace. Poland still has its rivaled. Denmark does too, obviously. Hungary likes us. Bohemia has its rivaled. Uh, next year, we can get our alliance back with Austria, which will be very nice. Who's in a regency council at the moment? Habsburg, Habsburg, Habsburgs, wow. Okay, let's bring our guy back from Muscovy. Uh, might as well, oh, let's like improve relations with Saxony. Maybe later on down the road we'll be able to uh, annex them. Okay, Teutons are maxed out. Uh, good, looks like we should be able to maintain that for quite a, a good little bit of time. We've got to wait two more years to start annexing these guys. October of... Or three years, actually. So it's going to be a while. Alright, I guess our guy's not going to die. So I will put a cut in here, guys. And uh, then when we come back, we'll just keep going with um, the current play. Hopefully, when our leader dies, we will uh, lose our royal marriages with Poland and Denmark and be back down to a reasonable number of diplomatic relationships. And then starting in October of 1488... We'll start incorporating the Teutonic Order into our country, and then uh, the other, uh, these guys, the other little one province miners in the HRE that we got, and we'll just piss off the entire HRE with that, uh, and then we'll just kind of chill out for a little while until the Protestant Reformation hits, and then we'll see what happens. So cool, thanks for joining me guys, I'll see you in the next video.